Good morning. It is 9.05 and I'm headed to the gym. Oh, my hair. Um, yeah, headed to the gym this morning. My dog woke me up at 6 a.m. So I've been awake since 6. Um, I got distracted looking at my phone and doing other stuff or else I would have gone to the gym earlier. But it's still pretty early in the day. I'm going to get my workout in before I really do anything else. My family is on vacation right now, so there's not really much for me to do. I may go out to their house and just kind of let my dog run around. Um, but yeah, went out to eat last night. Um, my friend wanted to do Chinese. So um, thank God the restaurant we went to had one of those healthy light option menus. So I got the chicken and broccoli um, from that and it came with egg drop soup so egg drop soup from what I can tell is pretty low calorie so that was a plus um, the broccoli and chicken itself obviously isn't going to be super low calorie but um, I think for the most part I stayed under about I stayed under about 800 calories for the meal I didn't eat the whole thing and so I, I think I did okay um, and, I, and I honestly don't even know if you could consider that like a cheat because I did go for the healthier option. So, I don't know. But, um, yeah, I'm headed to the gym. I've got my shake with me. This is my strawberry today. Um, got the new color of the, the shaker. They have a turquoise one right now, so I'm gonna go maybe check that out when I get home. Um, or maybe look at it while I'm at the gym on my phone and maybe get that too because it's so cute. I saw it on Instagram this morning and it's super adorable and I, I really want it. Um, but I actually really like this purple one. So um, I actually got two of these. Um, I had ordered, I'd made two separate orders um, when they were having their like their prime day sale um, where like you can get up to 75% off. Um, so I got this shaker with my like strawberry shake and my lemonades and then I got the other purple one um, when I ordered my thin supplements and the chocolate shake um, chocolate shake if I'm honest I wasn't like super thrilled about it wasn't awful and I'll reorder it um, but I haven't tried strawberry yet so let's see what it tastes like all right it's not very strawberry like you get a little bit of a little bit of strawberry it smells like strawberry but it almost just tastes like like a strawberry vanilla type flavor where it's like a vanilla and it just got a hint of strawberry it's not bad I'll reorder this one too but I got to finish that before I get to the gym but yeah I am going to be doing that I think I'm gonna do less weight training today at the gym and do more cardio because um, like I, I was saying in my last vlog I, vlog I think I'm hitting that plateau that everybody hits and I don't want to do that so I'm gonna try to burn as many calories as I can um, but I was watching a video this morning by this like fitness trainer fitness model health guru dude um, and he was saying something like if your caloric intake is no how did he say it it was like if your caloric intake is less than your caloric outtake it's going to slow down your metabolism and that's going to make it so that every food you do eat gets stored for energy so i think i'll, I'll maybe like research it but right now this is what's working for me and i'm going to stick to it i don't want to like introduce a whole new diet thing not even two full months into it because I'm hitting a plateau I want to stick to it and see if this is you know if it's just a, a plateau that I can overcome but yeah I'm gonna do that I will check in with you after the gym um what is that oh got a little tiny pimple hmm, maybe it's a hive Hopefully it's just a hive and it's not an actual pimple because I hate pimples. But yeah, I'm going to go ahead and do that and I will check in with you after the gym. Bye. Alright, so I'm just now leaving the gym. 
thirsty as hell, like always. I'm gonna go and grab some, I almost said some soda, some coffee. Um, go to Starbucks really quick since it's right over here. Um, but yeah, it was a good workout. Sweated like a pig, more than I normally do. There she goes there. Um, so, I did my treadmill, like always. Um, the bikes were pretty full this morning, so I decided to go ahead and do the elliptical. Um, the first, I did it twice while I was at the gym. The first time, um, I was just, I think I was trying to go too fast, and I overwhelmed myself, and I got off after five minutes. Um, I mean, not the worst thing, but definitely not, you know, worth, worth it. Um, so I got off and I did the tall bike and um, did 10 minutes of that. Then I got back on the elliptical because I decided not to do very many weights today. Um, got back on the elliptical and I think I found a pace and a, like a level of intensity, I think that's what you, how you say it. Like the level that you set your machine to. I think I found the right mix to be able to do it. Um, and I stayed on for almost 20 minutes. I did a mile on there. Um, burned roughly like 210 calories, I think it was, which is fantab. Um, I haven't even took that much in yet today. Um, so that's good start to the day. Give me a little bit of extra room. But yeah. Um, and then I did do one uh, weight. I did my... Don't get on my ass, dude. Yeah, I think I'm gonna get a cold brew again today. It's low calories. I'm tired. Nick says, how about Starbucks? What can we get started for you? Uh, can I get a venti cold brew, please? Yeah, did you just want that black? Yes. Perfect, 396, I'll see you up here. Thank you. Yeah, of course. Yeah, of course. Um, so yeah, um, lost another two pounds, so I'm officially down 27 pounds, which is awesome. I'm almost to my 30 already. How crazy is that? Almost to the 30 pound mark. I'm gonna go home, probably make some eggs and turkey bacon for breakfast. Come on. Um, I do have to go to the store today and pick up some groceries. I've run low on chicken. I have a couple of, I think I have two packages left of those steam fresh veggies. Um, I need almond milk, juice for me to take with my fiber. There was something else that I wanted. Oh, I was actually gonna stop. Ooh, I wonder if I should just go back and do that. Um, I wanna see if I can get a coffee maker with like a grinder on top. I got one of the girls that I work with, she's super awesome. She actually used to work with my mom. Um, she went to Hawaii recently and she brought me back some Hawaiian coffee. And I ended up using the grinder at work to grind up the coffee grounds because they were, or the coffee beans because they were like the full, full bean. What the, I'm just breaking out today. I'm just, my face is not happy. It's gonna be a face mask kind of, kind of day. But um, I want to get one of those coffee makers that has the grinder built in. So I don't have to use the one at work to grind up my coffee beans. Because I love fresh ground coffee. Like, that is so good. It's so... Oh, it's so good. And I don't want to have to um, use the grinder at work. So, I don't know. I think I maybe... Well, you know what? Maybe I'll go to Appleton tonight. Give me something to do. And I'll go to World Market see if they got something there um, or not world market um, what was I thinking world market the other place that's got like a million things and you're just like oh I need this in my life I can't think of it I know exactly where it is it's between um, Barnes and Noble and Old Navy can't think of the name anyways I think I maybe go there and see what they got for coffee makers slash grinders 
Um, <gasps> Beagle puppy. Oh, well, branches. Oh, he's not a puppy. He's kind of old, but he's so cute. I love beagles. My parents have had two beagles in the last, I think, like seven years or whatever. Um, our first one, Peaches, unfortunately got hit by a car. Um, so she's, she's no longer with us, but we have Jack now. Well, they have Jack now. He's such a little love bug. He is so cuddly and just so, uh, he doesn't, neither of them would give kisses very often. Like it was rare that they gave a kiss. Um, they adopted both of them. So they came from the Humane Society. Um, so th that makes me think like maybe their owners prior didn't let them give kisses, which I'm all about my dog giving me kisses. I don't care. Like I ask my dog all the time, can you give me kisses? And she just starts licking up a storm and but yeah, I, my family loves beagles. They're so incredibly loyal and so incredibly just like, they're fun. It, you can get Jack to play more than you could get Peach to play. Peach was just a lazy bum, but she loved to cuddle with you and she was like that dog that if she knew you were upset, she would not leave your side. And she could always tell when you were upset. She would, I got sick one time and she sat in my bedroom the whole day, right next to my bed. Um, she just didn't want to leave my side and I had to force her to like go outside to go to the bathroom. I had to like go and sit outside with her so she would go outside because she just wouldn't. Um, but yeah, uh, I, I, that got a, a weird tangent. I saw a dog and I'm just like, Phew, dog. But yeah, um, <laughs> totally off any kind of subject of where we were going with that. Um, coffee makers. <laughs> so I may go up to Appleton and see if I can find one. Um, if I have to get like two separate things, I mean, I will. I don't want to, but I will. Um, because I have a Keurig right now, but like the majority of the Keurigs are like high calorie. Unless you just get like regular coffee. Um, my favorite is the donut shop um, nutty caramel one. That's my favorite coffee. Um, and that's actually, I scanned it into my app and it's actually only two calories per pod, which is not terrible. Um, and it gets you about, um, 10 ounces of coffee, like max, which isn't bad. Um, but it's, it's, I feel like I'm kind of wasting money on it because like in theory it was a really good idea, but now that I'm like getting up in the morning and I'm like getting up so early, I, I'm gonna want more than one cup of coffee. So my thought is, is like, get a coffee maker to be able to make enough coffee to make, you know, two, three cups of coffee um, to get me going in the morning. So that's kind of what I wanna do that for. Um, I'm trying to think of anything else is, is going on today. Nothing really. It turned out to be a pretty decently weathered day. It was supposed to be kind of crappy and, and rainy, but right now it's turning out okay. I got some more, I, I don't know if I told you this, but I got, um, I started doing the Fabletics leggings, and like the workout clothes. I got um, these black like legging capris, which I'm obsessed with. They have pockets, guys. They have pockets. Anything that has pockets, I'm obsessed with. I hate nothing more than like wearing leggings to the gym and having to carry my phone around with me because I don't have anywhere to put it. So then I saw those on Fabletics and I immediately put them into my um, my shopping cart. And I'm like, these are mine. So I got those and I got two pair and a sports bra for my first order. And then they had a huge, huge sale a couple days after. And um, I got in total in two separate orders because there was something, I was doing it on my phone at first and then something weird was happening with the website where it wouldn't load. So I just immediately checked out to make sure I got the ones that I wanted. Um, but I um, got a total of nine pairs of leggings, which is a lot, but I didn't spend any more than a hundred dollars. Now I, like the leggings were no more than like 10 bucks each. Some were five, some were 10. Like that's how big of a sale it was, is that good quality workout clothes were like five, 10 bucks. 
it was insane. Like normally when you look at the website, they're like 50 bucks. That's huge. Um, so yeah, that was awesome. Um, but I just got one of the shipments in yesterday. I got a couple pairs of leggings. Um, I didn't wear those to the gym because I wore the black ones with the pockets. Um, but I am obsessed with them. They're so comfy. Um, and at first I was kind of afraid that I'd gotten a size too small, but they actually fit me perfectly. One pair is actually even just a slightly too big for me, um, but I'm gonna wear them anyways because they're cute. And I don't, I'm not, you know, at the gym to impress people, not yet. But I'm not, I'm not there to be like, oh, look at my butt, boys. Mm -hmm. I don't have a butt to begin with, but like, I just, it doesn't matter. So I'll wear them anyways. Um, they're cute. But I got five more yesterday, and I think four more four or five more coming in the mail soon. Um, so that's awesome. Um, I think that's pretty much about it for right now. I don't... Thirsty as hell today. And it's actually a pretty good brew today. Sometimes it's too strong and it's just like bitter as ugh. But this is actually like a pretty good balance of like straight up coffee. And I don't know. I don't know where I was going with that but it's not too bitter, it's not like sweet or just not strong enough, it's just kind of right in the middle. It's perfect. Um, but yeah, I'm headed home right now. Um, probably hang out for just a little bit and then go to the store and pick up my stuff. But yeah, I'm gonna head home, put on some CNCO because I just love them, they're fantastic. I'm from Wisconsin, so I have very little Spanish knowledge, but I don't care. So it's great. It's great. Um, I can understand like half of what they're saying, so I get the point. I get the point. But it's okay. It's okay. Um, yeah, I'm gonna head home, hang around for a little bit, eat lunch, and then go to the store. And I'm off tomorrow. I don't know what to do with myself on like a full weekend. I'm just, I'm a little bit like, woo. Cause I, it's been a really long time since I've had a full weekend off. Like, scheduled. <laughs> um, well, I've had like PTO, but it's never felt like a weekend. It's weird, to, it's weird, but it's never felt like a weekend. Um, so I don't know what to do with myself right now. I'll figure it out. But I, I'm going to go and tell everybody I've lost 27 pounds. Not really, but um, I tell my mom wherever she is. I think she's in Cincinnati right now. I think that was their plan. Uh, they're staying with my uncle, one of my uncles, and then the other uncle is in a band. And the one uncle is going to have a party, and my uncle's band is going to play. Yeah. Um, I've seen him play. It's been a really long time since I've seen him play in a, in a band or in his band or really any time. Um, he's a drummer, so. But, but from what I understand, he's a really good drummer. From what I remember from when I saw him, he's a good drummer. Um, yeah. I will probably call my mom later just to say hi, because I miss my mom. I don't like when they go places without me, because then I'm here by myself, and I'm just like, Meh. mom, mom. But yeah. Alright, I'm gonna shut up because this is rambling and it's just getting long. So, unless anything happens, I will catch you. Actually, you know what? I think I'm going to go to the gym again tomorrow because I enjoyed my workout today. Like, I enjoyed it. I think I'm going to go again tomorrow. Um, maybe tomorrow and Monday. We'll see how I feel Monday after work, but most likely again tomorrow. Um, give me something to do in the morning, you know what I mean? Because now I have the rest of the day to kind of just chill. Um, but yeah. I'll catch you guys probably tomorrow afternoon or Monday.